The Bible says, But none of these things move me, neither count I my life dear unto myself, so that I might finish my course with joy in the ministry which I have received of the Lord Jesus to testify the gospel of the grace of God. Here, as Paul was preparing to head to Jerusalem for what he knew would probably be his final mission, he realized he just wanted to finish strong. He wanted to finish his course with joy. He didn't care so much about his life. He was willing to lose his life that Jesus Christ and his testimony might be made manifest to a lost and dying world. And today, dear child of God, rest assured, there is one thing the world, the flesh, and the enemy wants out of you today. They want you to quit. They want you to give up. They want to knock you so far off course that you just give up and don't ever try to find your way back to God again. And like the Apostle Paul, who is our ensample and our pattern, we must covenant in our own mind that we're not going to quit. We're not going to give up. And by the grace of God, we will finish strong for the Lord Jesus Christ. The Bible says, Consider him that endured such contradiction of sinners against himself, lest ye be wearied and faint in your minds. Yes, the road may be long to heaven's pearly gate. We know that it's narrow. We know that it's straight. But if Jesus Christ was willing to do all that he did, that you and I might have eternal bliss, then don't we owe him that natural affection? to remain steadfast for the short span of time and the light affliction we endure down here. If Jesus Christ did all things well, don't we at least owe him the effort to try to finish strong? What a joy it will be to hear the Savior say, Well done, thou good and faithful servant. We don't know what exactly that servant did. We just know that servant was faithful. That servant did his best. And today, May you fall so in love with the Lord Jesus that the things that try to knock you off course may keep drawing you back to Jesus Christ that you might have the same heart as Paul, a heart that wants to finish strong for his God.